Hello, Coach Wadstead here. We're going to talk a little rankings for this week with my Big Ten teams. And I got a few changes for you. Let's start with Ohio State. They are the most complete team, I think, in the Big Ten. I think they're the most explosive team, making pass plays and running the ball on offense. And their defense is off the charts. I mean, you know, they've given up, what, three plays? All year, over 30 yards, that's that's incredible defense. Wisconsin moves up to number two. I, Paul Christ has done a fabulous job. With uh, four new offensive linemen, the way those guys are protecting the quarterback, uh, you know, obviously running the ball with Jonathan Taylor and Jimmy Leonard brought that defense around where they're playing with a lot of confidence. I'm keeping Iowa at number three right now because Iowa's Iowa. And uh, Kirk Ferentz, they're not beating themselves. You know, they're just not as explosive in my mind right now as Wisconsin is. But Stanley's playing good. He's protecting the ball. They're, they're consistent in all phases of their football team, and they win. I've got Penn State. Penn State just needs to tighten up a few things. I think talent-wise, other than Ohio State, they might be the second most talented team, in my opinion. You know, but when you're last in the Big Ten and converting third downs, that's going to catch up with you. So they've got some areas that they need to improve on. But I like Penn State sitting there at four, Michigan five. They need to regroup. They need to kind of get their their mojo back a little bit, their confidence back. I got Nebraska at six, Michigan State at seven. You know, some of the teams down there, and, and I don't have time to talk about everybody, but the Purdue's and Northwestern and Indiana and Illinois, I think they've all got good football teams and they've all got opportunities to, uh, to win enough games and, and get into bowl games and take the next step with their programs. See you next week.